For this video on matte pattern, I'm going to be using the fluorescent orange color combination. Start by coming in with the white 70 denier, attaching it to the hook shank, snipping off the excess. I'm then going to bring in the neon orange 70 denier. I'm going to pull it over the thread, fold it over, and as I lift the white thread, I'm going to slide this down on the opposite side of the hook shank. Secure it with three or four wraps, letting the bobbin side of the thread hang, and then coming in and snipping off the excess. I'm going to continue to wrap this back and slightly down the bend of the hook, trying to make sure that that orange thread stays on the opposite side of the hook shank. Once I get to this point, I'll return, making sure that I'm laying down side-by-side -side wraps with the white, all the way to the front of the hook. I want to stop a little bit behind the eye of the hook so that I don't crowd it. On a couple half hitches and snip the thread. Before bringing the 70 denier in orange forward, I'm going to give it a quick clockwise spin to tighten up that thread so that it doesn't flatten out as I rib. And I want to bring this forward with candy cane style stripes, leaving spaces in between. When I get to that last little bit in front of the hook point, I'm going to spin it in the opposite direction to open up that thread and lay down side by side wraps, creating a nice bright neon head portion of the fly. At this point, I'll secure it with two firm half edges and snip the excess thread. Then I'll come in with five minute epoxy and thinly coat the body 